Mike, what's the difference between actual and constructive possession? I get this question a lot. So with actual possession, generally the object is on my person. It's in my hand, in my pocket, something to that effect. Constructive possession, though, is very different. Constructive possession, generally the court looks to see whether or not I had the power and intention to exercise control over that object. What does that mean? That means that generally I was near the object, uh, that there is some evidence linking me to the object. Uh, for instance, if it's drugs, maybe I had a lot of cash on my person. Even if it's circumstantial evidence, the state can use that to prove that type of possession. That's very important to note. But either way, whether it's constructive or whether it's actual, it's very important to know that the state can convict you. You do not have to have the object on your person in order for the state to land a conviction.